What's up guys? Today, we're back working on the Malibu. Let me explain what's going on because this got way out of sorts. So, as some of you saw on Instagram, I posted a picture of the steelies on the Malibu and how much I did not like the steel wheels. So, I purchased some wheels, which took me a while to find what I really wanted, but I got them, got them on the car, loved the look, but now the car is too tall. It just looks weird because I went with 17s, which I think is a good size for the car, but at stock ride height, they, are, they just look weird. Like it needs to sit a little lower. So this led me to contemplating other issues. And where I wound up is with these H&R lowering springs. Now, I'm not just gonna do lowering springs. We're gonna do H&R springs. We're gonna do new strut mounts. We're going to do new KYB struts. We're going to do all of this today. So that is what we're doing. So let's get to it. I live inside my own world of make-believe kids screaming in the cradles profanities i see the world through ice covered in ink and bleach cross out the ones who heard my cries and watch me weep i love everything fire spreading all around my room my world's so bright, it's hard to breathe, but that's alright Hush Shh. The next thing to do after you build the struts here Is remove these two lower nut, nuts and bolts, which I've already done pretty easy to get out you just take the nut off and then knock the bolt through with a hammer then these three up here pull the old one out put the new one back in Okay, and now, finally, we're gonna take this out on the road and see how it drives, and I'll give you my impressions of this suspension setup on this car. Now, the alignment is gonna be pretty significantly off because I just put tie rods on it, and we just replaced all the struts and springs, and I haven't taken it to have it aligned yet, so keep that in mind. But so far, it doesn't feel too bad it's definitely stiffer than stock um, but it feels pretty stable and the struts seem to be doing a fairly good job i'm not getting a lot of unwanted bouncing or anything like that but i would say uh, pretty much it feels really good we'll take it up here we'll try to take a couple turns and see if there's a difference there i'm sure that in the turns not only are the is the suspension going to make a difference but the wheels and tires because i will say we went from a 215 to a 225 so we've got a little more contact patch on the road too so now we'll just run this down a curvy road and we will see what it feels like okay so now we're taking a few curves and i will say it definitely still has that front wheel drive 
underdrive or understeer push, which you kind of have to expect in one of these cars, especially one with stock sway bars. But as far as body rolls goes, it's definitely better than it was. It's a lot flatter through the turns, but it's still just really pushing a lot, which this is a very nose heavy car and it's front wheel drive. So I, I mean, understeer is expected. Uh, I am looking into ways to help that a little bit too, but I don't have any leads yet. So uh, we will get to that eventually. But yeah, I would say overall, uh, it's pretty good. So let's just get this back to the house and I'll give you my final thoughts. So that is it for right now, done for today. Uh, I'm pretty happy with this modification. I know these springs will probably settle a little bit, so they're probably not gonna be as tall as right now, but this is a pretty workable height, I think, for a daily driver. So I'm pretty happy. Let me know down in the comments what you think, or if you've got any ideas for anything else you think I should do to this car but I think it's coming along pretty good. We still got a little bit more work to do, but I'm gonna have to get back to the Grand Prix pretty soon because the 07 needs some stuff. And we got a big project on the 99 now that I've decided to do. So all that's in the works. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel so you see it when it happens. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks so much for watching and peace.